Today, I will show you 10 best VS Code extensions or Visual Studio Code extensions which saves my time a lot and boosts my development process. So the extension number one is Code Snap. This extension is very useful for sharing your code snippet. Let me show you. So after installing this extension, press Ctrl plus Shift plus P and like Code Snap and hit Enter. This will open a new tab for preview. And then using at any code, you can see that in this snippet image. After that, click on this icon to save this image of code snippet and see how professional it looks when you share this image to somewhere. And one more good thing about this extension is it will copy your code color, same as our theme selected. So sometimes I use jellyfish theme for sharing my code snippets. You can also customize this background color from second. So open second and just search for the snap. And here even change this background color and all of these seconds. Now extension number two is Foca. This extension is my favorite because using this extension, then we are working on any big project and we want to test like a JAS hip code. Then we go need to add HTML5 and then run it and using console we see output. All these steps are not needed. Just install this extension and press Ctrl plus Shift plus P and search new JAS Swift file and hit enter. Now I just add here some JAS Swift code and we elegantly output at side and in the bottom tab also. Now let's see extension number 3 which is code time. This extension is useful then you want to track your coding time and overall analysis of your code time. For that, you have to just install this extension and then you have to register your account. After that, you don't see your code time. I personally don't use this extension because I like to focus on quality amount of time rather than quantity amount of time. Now extension number 4 is VS7 React Snippet. This is very useful and pan-sailor extension for JavaScript or React or React Native or even Vigas users. It has a lot of snippets, you can watch them all from here. See, we are our snippets by each section. I always use this extension in my old projects and I love this. Now extension number 5 is Freakier. This is the extension every developer use in VS Code. They will format your code in very organized manner. You don't need to worry about formatting your code when you sell your file when it will format your code. So let's see the installation process of Brickyard because it is a little confusing. So first of all, install this extension and in the installation section, scroll down with the default format section and copy this first line of code. Now open up settings and at the top right corner, open this second or JSON file and at the end, paste this line. Save this and back to setting and search format on save and enable this. Now you can see when you save the file, pretty hard format the code. Now extension number 6 is live server. Live server is used to run your HTML file live in your browser. So if you change something in your HTML file by working on your project, then you have to refresh your browser manually to see the changes. But when you run your HTML file with Live Server, you don't need to worry about that. Live Server will automatically refresh your page. Now extension number seven if VSSP. So this is very useful extension when you are working on live project of the HTML and CSS. So when you install that extension, you can press Ctrl and hover the class means. Here, you can see their skies. And when you click on that, with holding Ctrl, then you directly move to this style in your CFS file. Let's see the extension number 8, which is work on rename tag. This is also useful for HTML users. So if you are working on your project, and you decide to change with main tag, so it's a new tag, then you have to first change here and at the end, we have to again rename browsing tag. 
but by using this action chat, if you change opening tab, then closing pad will also automatically name. Now, exclusion number nine is that like our comment. This is useful action chat. Then you want to add this delete comments in your code. This action chat will help you to like comment in colorful forms. If you want to add highlight, then add star at like the beginning. Same for exclamation mark, suggestion, or to do comments. This is pretty better than normal video comment. Now, last extension, which is hungry Ginui. Suppose sometimes you have this type of code, and when you want to remove this empty space, then you have to press the X space so many times. But after installing this extension, you have to just press Ctrl plus backspace or time, and see all space removed. So these are not quite this extension, what are the code? Extension are only a tool for saving your time. Basically, what are your facilities? If you have some extension with your life, then you can govern that extension name. I love Brook Eye Death. And if you want to know my best themes for VS Code, then you can also check this video. See you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.